back to parking lot case study. Uh, we're looking at challenge number three, which is drainage. So when it rains, and I wish it would, this is January, and look at this sky, it's just amazing. Well, I say amazing, but immediately I think, where's the rain? We need the rain here in California. But nonetheless, uh, we're talking about how this surface, um, the parking lot surface, drains water. Now this is, this is what dates this parking lot, because where the water goes, it slopes down, and eventually we find the drain, which is right over here. And this is a standard catch basin. It has this gap in the concrete, so the water from that side can flow into here. And of course, all the flow from this side of the parking lot will go here as well. This is a classic engineered design where we want to get rid of the water as quickly as possible. I'm just seeing where this tree is is a high point. Well, actually where that tree is is a high point. But then if we follow the slope down, we can find the other catch basin right over here. So, old design trying to get rid of the water as quickly as possible, but the problem with that is the water will um, carry with it all the pollution from the parking lot, the sediment, heavy metals, oil, all that, and just go directly into this, and this goes directly to our waterways. You'll find in new parking lots that they have green stormwater infrastructure that captures that water and creates a, a cleaning mechanism, low impact cleaning mechanism for the water before it hits our waterways. And I'll look at that in another video. So this is stormwater capture is challenge number three.